On the battlefield, he is a bastion of defensive power and a man of few words. But who is this mysterious lieutenant really? And what does he bring to the fray? Introducing the Lone Wolf Defender, Lieutenant Wolfgang. His specialty, Resolute Technique, erects a cybernetic force field in retaliation to enemies targeting your tank units. This specialized shield has a chance to be cast upon a friendly unit stack and shield them for 30% of the received damage, and upgrading it increases its strength. Lieutenant Wolfgang has improved his Resolute Technique in recent years with Malware Remover, using his force field to protect all units from a number of incoming debuffs for the entire battle. Upgrades to Malware Remover increase the amount of debuffs successfully avoided. This penchant for defense-first combat is something of a rarity amongst the soldiers of War Planet. How did Wolfgang become such a stalwart force of peace? It started in Berlin with the von Brandt family, headed by decorated war hero and aging general Ludwig von Brandt. A tireless soldier in his prime, he swore allegiance and absolute loyalty to the military when his hometown was wiped off the map. Years later, forced into retirement, he decided he'd turn his children into vessels for his warmongering dreams. Wolfgang, the eldest of Ludwig's four sons, was his pride and joy. Quiet and direct, intelligent and strong, Wolfgang was dutiful, respected, feared, and utterly miserable. Though he took great pains to hide it, Wolfgang hated competing with his brothers and hated hurting others. Family expectations weighed heavily upon the shoulders of an otherwise gentle young man who preferred book learning, tinkering, and mending torn clothes after forced sparring sessions. His only solace became clandestine conversations with his estranged elder sister, the exiled first child and only daughter of the von Brandts, Sweet Tanya, a fashion designer on and off the battlefield. She had escaped their father's iron fist when Wolfgang was still a boy. A mercenary herself, She'd forged her own way in a world at war, and knew that another way was possible for her brother. Tanya had reconnected with an old field medic from her father's glory days, a man who had used his knowledge of the human body to develop defensive combat techniques. Techniques that Ludwig outright ignored for the entirety of their careers. Tanya knew introducing this man to her younger brother would at last give Wolfgang purpose, or at least a spark of inspiration. The three met in a secret meeting. In his own quiet way, Wolfgang was overjoyed. Combining these defensive techniques with his burgeoning engineering ideas could minimize casualties on the battlefield. If he could just develop them in secret, perhaps he could put a stop to the bloodshed he knew his brothers were being groomed for. Wolfgang began to lead a double life, keeping up appearances as the golden boy of his family while attending nightly lessons in combat healthcare, defensive strategy, and battle tech. Luckily for him, his secret was successfully masked by his quiet nature and intense mannerisms. The rumors about him and his reputation were far more frightening than anything Wolfgang could imagine himself. He wasn't torturing POWs and practicing on live cannon fodder in his spare time. He was reading, engineering, and using his prototype shields to protect refugee camps. But as the years went by, and the long war caused casualty after casualty, many of them courtesy of the growing von Brandt children, it became far more difficult for Wolfgang to hide his true nature from his family. Wolfgang could no longer turn a blind eye to his true calling, he could no longer be complicit in his father's destructive wishes. Lying was painful, and honesty became a necessity. Wolfgang eventually came clean to Ludwig. He wanted no part in the von Brandt Empire. He wanted to be a shield, not a sword, and he had the smarts to do it. If his father and his brothers would only believe in him, maybe they could protect people together. So he was given an ultimatum, follow Ludwig's path and be a proper soldier, or leave the family. The choice was clear. Wolfgang von Brandt left, shedding his family's legacy and fearsome surname to become simply Wolfgang. A lone wolf who goes his own way, who helps others, who makes his own pack, and protects them beneath the mighty light of his resolute technique.